This video will feature our ErgoGrip products. It is part of a series of videos that will teach an Air 15 user how to install our grips, forends, buttstock, and accessories to your firearm. We're going to start with an Air 15 that has had its forend and stock removed. The first step would be to add the buttstock to this receiver. In other videos, we will add the forend and accessories. We start by disassembling the sliding portion of the stock. So you push your release and locking levers and your takedown button. Slide the stock off. Position your castle nut first, then your end plate with the sling attachment points. Now there are two springs and two detents needed for this installation. The first one is a buffer retainer that comes in from the top. Take your spring and retaining pin, push it down. It's just holding it in, that's where you need to have it. You go a little bit extra so that your sling plate will clear the detent hole in the back of the receiver. Put in your detent and your spring. You're going to have to hold that in while you rotate the sling plate around. Push it against the sling plate against the receiver. Turn the castle nut in place. And you use your wrench. This wrench uh, works perfectly because of the thinness. Now, you're going to either stake it in place or I'd recommend some blue Loctite to keep this castle nut from backing off. At this point you can go ahead and put your buffer and buffer spring in. That is the installation of the stock. 